How y'all doing? My name is uh, Christopher Yancey, and I, uh, I've been with the city 11 years. And basically, this is like a cry for y'all help. You know, we've been dealing with understaff before the pandemic hit. And we're just letting y'all know that basically, you know, this is an ongoing issue that we're dealing with, you know, like in my department, water resources, I can speak that like basically on Saturday and Sunday, you got one truck catching water and sewer calls for the whole city. I don't see no sense in it. I mean, basically you're overworking your workers. We have hard times trying to fill in, like whenever somebody take off, basically we have to beg and ask people, do you want to work over? And it ain't guaranteed that they can work because then they got stuff that's planned for the weekend or something like that, that nature. But basically this is like a crowd for help. We city workers, man. I mean, we come to work every day, clock in and clock out. And we do the work that needs to be done in the city, you know, and uh, we know we take pride in maintaining the infrastructure that we come across day in and day out. We just want y'all to basically have our back and don't, we feel like y'all basically ain't there for us. Like basically I said, this is like a crowd for help and we just want y'all to hear us because we feel like we don't have nobody else to run to. And another thing, you know, when a new worker comes to work and work for the city, they want to know what they're going to be making years and years on down the road. They don't want it to be a surprise. Like, you're not guaranteed to get a raise with this merit system that's in, play, in place now, basically. No matter how good of a worker you are. We're basically just saying that we're essential workers and we want essential pay. And that's all I have. Thank you.